Percy ran away from Sodor to have his own big world adventure. He saw so many amazing things on his journey and was even reunited with his old friend Gator. But the world is a big place and Percy soon got lost along the way. Luckily, my friends and I from Sodor were searching everywhere for him, including a desert in Egypt where Emily and I got caught in a sandstorm. Emily, look, there's an old temple. We can stay there until the storm blows over. I don't know, Thomas. That temple doesn't look safe. We don't have a choice. We have to seek shelter. Oh, thank goodness. We should be safe now, Emily. Emily? I'm afraid your friend isn't here. It's just me and my camel. Well, then I have to go back out and find her. Emily! Emily! <coughs> Emily! Thank goodness you're safe! Thank you, Thomas. Looks like I should have listened to you this time. Emily and I were glad we found shelter, but we had no idea where to look for Percy next. Luckily, the archaeologist had an idea. Why not retrace your steps, starting with one of the places you went on your last adventure? But Percy could be on the other side of the world by now. That's it! We'll go to Australia! Meanwhile, James and Rebecca were passing a red carpet premiere in Los Angeles. Some photographers invited them to join in on the fun. Why, thank you, thank you. Oh, you're too kind. Your turn, Rebecca. Yay. Don't worry, Rebecca. Accidents happen. Let's try it again. But this time, follow my lead. Picture perfect. Well done, Rebecca. Thank you, James. Is that Percy? It sure is! We have to catch the next boat to Australia right away! After one last picture... Elsewhere, Mia and Gordon had just arrived at Easter Island. Goodness me, what are those? These statues are called Moai, and they were carved by the Rapa Nui people. Pretty neat, eh? Did you know that the Moai were carved Mia, from the... look out! Oh, no! Hang on, Mia. I'm coming! You, are you all right, Nia? That was fast thinking, Gordon. You are faster than a bullet train. I guess I was. Now let's see if we can find Percy just as fast. Unfortunately, Gordon and Nia didn't find Percy on the island. But a captain at the port had good news for them. Aye, I've seen this Percy. Just dropped him off at Australia. Since I'm heading back there, you two can hitch a ride with me. Then it's off to Australia for us. Luckily, when Gordon and Nia arrived in Australia, all my friends were reunited. Except for Percy. We still had no idea where he could be. G'day, mates. What brings you to Australia? Is Thomas taking you all on a holiday? No, Ace. We're looking for our friend Percy. Did you say Percy? 
I remember that engine came to my rally. After I won, he and some creaky old truck congratulated me and caught a ship to India. Well, then there's no time to lose. We have to catch the next ship to India. When my friends and I arrived in India, Charubala told us that Percy was working with Ashima in the Nilgiri Mountains. Ashima was pleased to have some extra help, but she could tell Percy was feeling homesick. If you miss your friends this much, maybe it's time to go home, Percy. You're right, Ashima. Ready to go home, Scruffy? Oh, finally! Back to Sotor! I thought we'd be here all season! Wait, Percy! Before you leave, would you mind sorting out these trucks for me? Just be careful, though. The rock face can be unstable. Of course! But Percy was too excited to be careful. Wasn't rocky enough. The bridge! It's collapsing! Keep going, keep going! Percy and Scruffy weren't hurt, but now they were floating away down the river. Oh, help! Help! <gasps> Look, it's Percy! Thomas, you have to help us! We're heading for the edge of that waterfall! Oh no, we have to save Percy right away! Does anyone have any ideas? Hmm... Luckily, clever Nia had a plan. First, James and Emily pushed some trucks into the river to keep Percy and Scruffy from floating away. Then my driver brought a chain out to the bridge, so Percy's driver could attach it to Percy. Oh. Whoa. Finally, Rebecca and Gordon were attached to the chain so they could pull him to safety. Ready? Heave! Working together, we saved Percy and Scruffy just in time. Thank you, everyone. After Percy told us why he ran away, we knew it was important to apologize. We're sorry about your accident with the water tower, Percy. We promise to work together in the future. Because you're our friend. My best friend. Thank you. And I'm sorry I ran away and made everyone worry. Having my own adventure was fun. But to be back on Sodor with all my friends, I wouldn't miss that for the world. <clears throat> I don't suppose anyone came all this way because they were looking for me. 
<laughs> now, how about a song for the journey? We make a team together. One, two, three. We go full steam together. Him, you, me. Best of friends forever will be. Yeah, yeah. Better together. Well, there's nothing that I couldn't do when I'm steaming along next to you. We make a team together. One, two, three. We got full steam together. Hey, you, me. We roll along together. All the way. Well done to all of you. Thank you, sir. It's nice to know that all of our friends are safe and sound on Sodor. Well, <clears throat> I'm afraid that's not the case. You were all gone so long I sent Diesel, Philip, Edward, Henry, Toby, and Diesel 10 out looking for you. Uh oh. Do you ever get the feeling that someone's trying to get rid of us? I spy with my little eye something beginning with C. Worst cruise ever. <laughs> <laughs>